Social and trade union movement ratified the continuation of the indefinite strike after rejecting the latest measures imposed by the government of Laurentino Cortizo on economic issues. The freezing of the price of gasoline at $3.95 a gallon, a measure that from the beginning was rejected by union leaders and social movements. The organization Alianza Pueblo Unido por la Vida and Anadepo denounced the government for not yet presenting a real solution to the main problems experienced by the people of Panama, such as the high cost of living and corruption in the state. Socio and workers' organizations continue to mobilize against the neoliberal policies of the Laurentino Cortizos government. The government must attend to all the organizations that were summoned in this case, those who are in the streets demanding to solve the problem of the situation that aggravates the country in terms of health, food and fuel. We as an organization are here and will continue in the struggle until the people sit down to talk and look for an answer. Getting them out of the hands of the PRT, its business allies and traditional parties will be one of the most difficult tasks for the Panamanian social movement. All is not lost, gentlemen of the police. Even if you are on the other side, you are our brothers. You are part of the people, and that doctrine that the U.S. has gradually put in your head has to come out, and it will be a product of the experience of what you are suffering in your homes.